Good Growing is sponsored by Salisbury Greenhouse. Plants, gifts, fountains. Salisbury Greenhouse in Sherwood Park. Today on Good Growing, we're talking about fertilizers. You have your plant, it's beautiful. Now you gotta feed it. But what fertilizer do I choose for what plant and what do I want to do and what do those three numbers on the fertilizer jar mean? So we're going to talk about that today. I have three different types of uh, water soluble fertilizer here. It means it dissolves in water. The three numbers here, you have 15, 30, 15. These are the percentages of three different chemicals, nitrogen, phosphorus, potassium in the fertilizer. Now a good way to remember what these three numbers do is top, down, all around. The first number, the nitrogen, is going to give you beautiful leaves, it's going to give you a rich, healthy plant, but it's not necessarily going to give it that kick into flowering. The second number um, is going to really fertilize the roots and get the roots growing, and that's what brings out your flowers. So if you want a plant to really flower vigorously, give it a high second number. And the last number is like a multivitamin for the plant. It's all those micronutrients like zinc and iron that uh, it is like a multivitamin, it's very important. So this is a flowering plant fertilizer because it has a high middle number. This one has a very high middle number. This is a plant starter. This is like a cup of coffee for the root system. And this is your all around. If you're, this is the best, uh, when you're in doubt, this is the best fertilizer you can give pretty much any plant because it does have the high last number, the 20 uh, is high for last number. So it's got all those micronutrients that a plant needs. So that's breaking down fertilizers, interpreting the numbers, today on Good Growing. Good Growing is sponsored by Salisbury Greenhouse. Plants, gifts, fountains. Salisbury Greenhouse in Sherwood Park.